Hey there, if you're interested in the Sneakio extension, you're probably finding yourself on this familiar page. I'm gonna do a quick rundown on how to install it and get you set up. Start by adding it to Chrome and then hit the add extension. It tells you that it's installed. The only thing that you're gonna to wanna to do right off the bat is manage this extension. And in order to get the most benefit out of Sneakio, you wanna allow it to run in incognito mode. Or you don't have to, but it is an option that is there for you. Now the last thing to do, as far as the extension is concerned, is to log in. If you have already set up your account on sneakio.com, then just type in your username and password here. If not, we have a registration button that'll bring you right to our page and you can do all that there. The only thing that you'll have to do is confirm your registration with your email address. But once you confirm your account through that email, you'll be all set to go. So I'm gonna go log in right now. And the last step is naming the computer you're on. So if you are downloading this onto several browsers, if you own different computers, you may want to distinguish which ones you're using. So if I'm on my home computer, I'll just label this home. Click save and that's it. You're pretty much all set to go. So if I go in here and I yahoo.com, I'm gonna go back to sneakio.com, log in. Once you log in, you'll see your browsing history and you'll see that the last few websites that I visited are right there. If you decide to upgrade, we do offer two tiers, a silver level, which will allow you to see the last day's worth of browsing history, or you could upgrade to the gold level, which will give you the last 30 days worth of browsing history. But if you wanna keep using Sneakio for free, just stay on the browns level and you'll see the last hour's worth of web usage. That's it, it's pretty easy and simple. If you have any issues, reach out to us at support at sneakio.com.